we should just think of OBM really is about the, like a case of generalization. Like, okay, what do you mean? I, I mean that you've already got these absolute core skills, right? Yeah. For dealing with behavior analysis and dealing with people and their actions. Yeah. Well, businesses are no different. It's just their actions, right? Oh, it's, it's what you're yeah, engaging in. Gotcha. So, but really what we're talking about is generalization. When we start thinking about policies and procedures, it's really about the generalization of those policies and procedures into different environments. Like when you're on the regular road versus going off-road. So what you're saying is, although we're in a different setting, things still kind of work. Right. Like the general process is the same. Driving on the road versus driving on a mildly off-road scenario, it's no different. That's the kind of way you want to think about it with your organization. Even though it's obviously bumpier. It's a little bumpier, but the process is the same. I'm just going to slow down a little bit. Take it easy. Getting the effects still. Yeah, so we're good. Exactly. In fact. Processes are definitely holding. New environment, slowing it down, just getting some observations going. I mean, we could speed it up. Hang on, people. Oh, we gotta jump. So, but the point is, it still works. You know, we went from a regular highway. Yeah. I mean, it's twisty, but we went from a regular highway onto smooth. some off road. I missed how smooth it was. <laughs> Things were much smoother. It, it's a, it's a Jeep, Brad. Can <laughs> like. Can you understand the I don't know if your process is that robust, but we're going to... Good lord. <laughs> Imagine managing somebody like this. Like, this is what you're going to have to deal with. I know, like, right? You just got to... Oh, wow. That was a bit bumpy. Um, it seems to be some new breaths in here. Um, the good news is, folks, is that our processes are working fine. Um, we're still going up. We're still going up. And if you're thinking about a business, um, you think things are stable. Things are profitable. We're, we're keeping an eye on all our bottom lines, our KPIs, which we'll talk about some other time, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. um, and people. Like, yeah, they're doing. We're, we're doing well. They're happy. They're performing. I mean, happy is kind of a hard thing to measure, but you can ask them, right? So how are they're you? They're at least productive. They're productive. Yeah. Uh, that gets into an interesting point, though, mm -hmm. right? So productivity versus employee satisfaction, mm -hmm. or self-reported employee satisfaction. Yes. Satisfaction is a different issue than employee satisfaction altogether. Uh, too much shit to worry about. No. So, um, <laughs> so yeah, processes will generalize. And so we talk about two things with regard to generalization. I think that's one of the things that Brad and I really want to have home is that the first generalization is you as a VCBA doing OBM work. Yes. And just recognizing that literally the same skill set applies. You basically take, the, take a step back and treat the entire thing like you would a client. Yeah, Pay attention to what might be an MO. <laughs> Pay attention to your antecedents, your behaviors, your consequences. It's the same process. It's yeah. just you, bigger. The word of caution when you're generalizing from your processes. Is that. What's that? That problem. That problem? Yeah. That when, little hill? Yeah. This, well, when things get a little bit more difficult. When things change. Yeah, right? when things change and they get harder. Kind of well, like, like so. Kind of like so? Like we're yeah, pushing, yeah, so. yeah, we're, yeah, we're, we're going up. So going up now. Whew, made that one. Um, so point being that processes apply until they don't. Yes. When you make too many you changes in your organization. Talk about stretching a procedure. Just made it. Yeah, just made it. I mean, and we're we're in four low. We got the lockers in. So like, we did violate process. We're creating a new process mm. on the fly. And yep. so we should be writing this down, right? So and shh, we already have because we you know videos and stuff. But but yeah, <laughs> we should we should be. Yeah, if we were doing this for real. Do we, should we, should we sally forth and continue to find out the limit of our process? You gotta go to the brakes, man. It's science. This is my wife's Jeep. <laughs> <laughs> go till it breaks that, seems scary. That's, that's your bone to pick, not mine. <laughs> <laughs> I have an itch to scratch my, and a bone my, to pick. Here my, we go! Yeah. <laughs> so what you all can't see is what we can see up there. Yeah. And... Regular old driving, regular old procedures. I want a new handbook. <laughs> <laughs> right? You're basically going to get one. Yeah. Um, so we can rely on the old procedures, but it's probably not going to do us well. This is a, the trail's a little wet okay. um, and we're a little muddy, and uh, but I think we can make it. So we're still operating off the old policy and procedure manual, um, but... And which makes sense, right? Because we're talking about generalization. We can only do what we did. You can only do what you did. And because it's up till this point, we've been reinforced for doing all those things. It's been highly functional. So you mean it's going to happen again? 
it's going to happen again. Uh, and then we're going to generalize that. Mm -hmm. We're going to put ourselves in new scenarios and we're going to tell us those old things. Now, there's a rock coming through. Would you mind keeping that I would be absolutely thing? happy to. Um, that rock it. looks like an HR issue. It is definitely an HR issue. Um, I'm going to turn clear. into this. You're doing right, good. Here we go. It's going to slide on you. You're good. Okay. Clear right to the tire. Right behind. Right around there. So things okay. are a little slippery here, friend. Things I, are a little I, slippery. I, kind of slipping and sliding, and yeah. I, I, I don't think you're uh, getting the same uh, traction and procedures we used to. It's kind of my... Uh, Probably not, but yeah. that one went surprisingly well. Yeah, surprisingly uh, well. Better. So I guess procedures... See, there's an example where... <laughs> things were hairy, but... But the procedures still worked. Yeah. We didn't get it. We're, we're not past that limit we got, of the organization. We're getting right up to it. Yeah, we're getting right up there. And specifically, and that's, really that's, wanna, that's the trickiest part, though. Knowing where that stops. Yes. Yeah. You have to pay attention to the data. Like to, to, to what? The data. Where? In that case, the data would have been what? Like us sliding off the trail and getting stuck. And yep. Like, oh no, we're in trouble. Um, you get some wicked variability in what's going on, and right. It, very hit and miss. Suddenly, none of those old skills are working anymore. Yeah. Nothing. Which means you're on extension. Nothing stable. Nothing stable, and now you're in trouble because yep. you've got no way well, to deal with it. Policies are going to land where it gets reinforced, and you're not going to know what those are. Right. Exactly. You're flying blind in a sense. Oh. Yep. And then things are going to get constructed that could be good or not. So good. Right. Um, so policies and procedures and generalization, right? And I think one of the examples here that we're going to come back to throughout this video is that of scalability. A lot of people go, hey, we're, we're working fine. We got 10 clients. We got two PCBAs on staff. Life's going good. Let's let's ramp we got, it up. We got 15 people. We're, this is easy. Right. So yeah. let's double that. It you, should be the same thing. Yeah. Right? You, you can have dinner and figure out problems. Right. Yeah. Um, as you scale up to be bigger, those processes may not work. It's yeah. just like this particular thing here where we're just cruising along and following the whole rules of how to be on the road and where to put your hands at 10 and 2 and all that fun stuff. Maybe those don't work in these types of scenarios. Um, maybe they do. They might. I don't know. As we hit a tree. Like literally. Again. Listen to this. Yeah, we like this one. Oh. That one. That sounds mean to red paint. Shh. Spit. <laughs> I'm just going to watch this video. Here we go again. This is... I'll be real. This is that other. This is where this process is going to be. Yep. You want to go yep. hard right, but I can't go too hard right. Yep, you're right. good. You want to watch that rock on your left. Yep. Okay. Back to that generalization thing. Literally going one way. There you go. There you go. Way to go over it. Thank you. Yep. Okay. Okay. And we're you're good. Cleared it. Right. Yep. One more issue here. Got yep. a rock that we're sliding into, and we're good. Okay. Out of the got one on the right. Yeah, I got it. Cool. Jeep is sliding down the hill, not driving down the hill. This is, I guess, a great example. We're not driving. No. The tires are. We're sliding. You can see the trees moving. <laughs> we're not doing anything. Nothing. <laughs> we're currently not engaged behavior. Technically, no. <laughs> like, we're definitely not engaged in driving behavior. Yeah. We're engaged in sliding behavior. Yeah. <laughs> um, so processes are straight up failing. Like that sound. <laughs> I don't know what that was. I don't either, but oh, it, it was wasn't a good sound. Yeah. So we do have a spare. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Muddy. That's good. Do you hear any tire air, air whooshing? No. No. That whoosh. would be an indicator. Yeah. A key performance indicator. It, it key performance. A failure. Yeah. A complete failure. <laughs> So what you're telling me through this whole process is once you hit a certain scenario that policies don't uh, follow through with or continue, is essentially you found the bounds of your generalization gradient. <laughs> yeah, yes. Yeah, like, like, yeah, the bounds of your gradient. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> that, that's, boom, you hit the yeah. limit. There it is. <laughs> Wham, right So those lines of the graph point. are literally metaphorical walls. Yeah, it's yeah. Not, yeah, not these gentle tails on that. No, 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 no. scenario, no, no. it's more of a right. boom. Right. Yeah. Um, yeah, and I mean, it, it could be anything, right? It could be the number of staff you have. Um, mm. It could be, in my experience, uh, I found a generalization failure the moment we added services that were outside of ABA. Oh, okay. um, and really started pushing those yeah, services. Yeah. It was one thing to have them here and there, yeah, uh, doing services and things like that. It was another, another. thing all together to be like, well, we're gonna, we're, we need to be profitable. <laughs> yeah. ooh, ooh, there's a trail of it. No, we don't need that trail. We're nope. gonna stick on the main path. Why? Because we've been reinforced. That's exactly. Although it is a jeep, we've been reinforced. Why not? Maybe, maybe. Um, so the limits, we got the size of the organization is a natural limit. Um, another natural limit I found that's really odd is 
the people in your organization might be eliminated. They may not respond to the old processes. Maybe get new people and um, a new corporate climate, if you will, and things change. Well, we, I've observed that as well, where a set of people don't necessarily want to change. Right, and I hate the term want, and we can dig into that at yeah. another time, but setting up the environment so people will for not. the new response, yeah. and you're going to meet resistance. It's just, that's just the nature of how I do what I do, and I did what I do, and oh, God. that's all the worst I want to do. That, yeah. I think that's, that's something we need to come back to, is like <laughs> the worst phrase in business. I've, done, I've always done it that way. Yeah. Right? Isn't that what it is? Like, what you always do. If you always do, but you always did, yeah. you'll always get what, what you, you always, always got. got. Yeah, exactly. So, it's a dangerous phrase. We're going to do what we always did. Um, yeah. That's the way we've always handled it before. Uh, that's just an example of generalization and finding the limits of that generalization. Uh, and like I said, corporate size, uh, new services, maybe new locations, multiple sites, scalability. We keep coming back to that scalability thing. Because I think piece. that's a big one. It, that, it's what's a, that number? 25, 35, something like something that? Something like that. It's a, yeah. It throws a definite wrench or extraneous variable into your generalization. Right. And then you got to start thinking about how, how am I going to solve these same old problems in new ways? Mm -hmm. And how do you go about doing that? Right. It's hard to when you've been reinforced for your current policies. And now you're talking and about it'll changing. it'll feel like rewriting the same thing. Yeah. And, but, and now or you're have really, a habit to. Yep. That's exactly, precisely. And you're talking about changing the behavior of individuals within the organization. Yeah. And you're not really changing the reinforcers. <laughs> so you're increasing the effort and not necessarily messing with the quality, which is going to set you up for some fun, too. Magic mom. Yeah. This comes into play there. Now you got to, how do you make change fun? How do you make that mm -hmm. exciting? How engaging. Engage and worthwhile. Uh, yeah, that's what you want out of your people. You want them committed, right? And how do you get that? And that's mm -hmm. motivating operations is really what you're going to get into at that time. So Definitely. Anyway, we're rambling. We'll uh, just keep cruising and enjoying our processes as we can. While, while they things. still work. While they still work. And finding that it's getting easier, we must be getting reinforced. Uh oh. We can even shift. Man, I could set you up for some shift. fun too. Yeah. Awful bumpy, boss. Well, let's just be patient. Let's see what we got. You sure? Capture some data on this thing. I'm, I'm not feeling so great about it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. About how it's going. Well, you know, all we can do is go forward, right? I guess. Going backwards sometimes creates problems. Yeah. Let's see how our process is handled. Okay. I think they're going to be bad. <laughs>